What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Keith and in today's video, we've got the iPad out again and we're gonna be looking at how to create a post on LinkedIn. Now, it may seem very simple, but we're gonna go through it and do the different various things that are options available for when you do a post on LinkedIn. So first things first, you run your profile and this is the app version of it. So we're gonna be going through that. Along the bottom, you'll see home, my network, post, notifications and jobs. Where you want to go is a little plus sign and post. So we'll click on that and this brings up an option so you can create a post. So what we're going to do here is write down whatever you want to do for the particular post. So again, you can either type that down or you can use the microphone and it'll sort of type it in for you. So we'll do that. Hello, my name is Keith and welcome to my LinkedIn profile. I will be using this profile in the future to create videos such as how to create a profile, how to create a post, how to list job listings and so much more. It would be great to have you here and follow us on YouTube. Here is a quick photo of me at work. Enjoy. While the speech to text is generally accurate, I always like to double check and correct any sort of grammatical errors and things like that. So when I said, here's a quick photo of me at work, enjoy, it was supposed to be comma, enjoy, didn't do that, so I've added that in. So in the bottom right, you have the three dots for the ellipsis, and this is, gives you different options for the post. Now, if you want to add a media, you'll see there's a little media icon there. You can click that, add your photo in there. But we're gonna go in via the three dots, and as you can see, it gives you different options. The first one is media, so we're gonna go in there and we're gonna select the photo and we're gonna add that into the post. Now again, along the bottom, it gives you some things to edit. You can add alt text and all that other stuff, but we're just gonna leave it as is, so click next. And as you can see, that's come up in the post. Now, it gives you an option to delete that from the post or edit that, so we're gonna leave it as is because we're happy with that. As you may have noticed, the three dots have now disappeared when we've added this photo. So what you can do is you can delete that photo and that brings the three back. So then instead of adding a photo, you can add an event Event. so you can create this event here you can also create it with a template so this is like a, a thing that you see on Facebook with a funky background so you can add here and add different text so you can say hello stuff like that and then that will show up as that template click the three dots again you have a celebrate so you can put here as any sort of milestones or celebrations that you want to do so if you want to welcome someone new to the team if you're launching a project or something like that you can do this as well we've also got a job option so when you click on job but this lets you to create a job so you can post this on your profile to see you've either started a new job or left a job or things like that and there's also an option to create a poll so you can go on here and add a question and it gives you different poll options so people can answer those and you also have a document so if you want to upload a particular document so if you want to create a spreadsheet or something like that you, that you want to share with people you can upload that document and last but not least you've got a services option so if you're looking for someone such as a video editor a thumbnail designer anything to do with any job then you can go in here create a job and it'll get listed and people can find that and apply for it like I said we're just gonna go for the media so we're just gonna add this picture on next and add that back on now all you have to do is click post there is an option if you click on this little clock you can schedule a post but we're going to talk about that in a further detail on a different video so for now we're just going to click post and that is going to post that post to your LinkedIn profile so that's gone now that should be posted all you have to do is just refresh your profile and then when you scroll down your post will be right there so as you can see here that's the post and that's out on LinkedIn and that's how you create a post if you're interested in learning more things about LinkedIn, check out the playlist on the screen now. There's also a video with other LinkedIn things that you can find as well on the screen, so click that. It'd be great if you could leave a comment on how you found this. Did it work for you? Did you come across any issues and things like that? And it'd be great if you could subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. Until next time, see ya.